What's up, guys? Welcome back to the Monty Versus. We continue Nikki's first time watch through of Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, and today is the wedding part two and more Australia. More Australia? More ac actual wedding this time? <laughs> Maybe there will be an actual wedding. Who's getting <laughs> married? Hopefully, Alpha and Finster, because they're the only two useful characters on the show. That is true. But I guess there's only one way to find out. Starting Mighty Morphin Power Rangers season two, episode forty-two, right now. Yikes, that was loud. Explosion in our ears. <laughs> it was. <laughs> There's something like, you know how like some videos have the warning of, hey, don't, if you have headphones on, don't have this too loud. I think the two biggest successes of Lord Zed's tenure as a villain in this series is getting rid of the Green Ranger. Okay. And wearing down my willpower. That's not false. So where we left the <laughs> Rangers... They were fighting a bunch of Zed's monsters again that are not really Zed's, they're Rita's. I was gonna say, you know it's bad when Rita coming back what? is going to... Is gonna significantly increase the watchability of this season? Not even watch, like, I mean, partly that, but also be more of a threat. True. That's pretty bad. Because Zed, Zed is, like, more inefficient than Rita. Because yeah. at least Rita did destroy Kimberly's float that time. Yeah, because now he's sleeping! Now he's just sleeping, like, for <laughs> Oh, whoa, spooky Australia house. It, are they still in Australia? Yeah. Even remember, in this house? I'm pretty sure they... I'm pretty sure they didn't teleport, remember? That's, That's a great idea, Billy. Split up. <laughs> Tommy's like, I copied his homework. Tommy's like, I can probably take them all by myself, so if you guys want to just take, like, one... All right, at least I can say without a shadow of a doubt that the stunt performers oh. are making this show very watchable still. Oh, hell yeah. Because this is a really fun fight scene. Yes. Whoa, it's Goten. What's the matter, Ranger? Shouldn't you be laying in a swamp somewhere? <laughs> <laughs> Prolific voice actor John Yo Johnny Youngbach. I was gonna say, you might say he's a goat. <laughs> who's who, who's Rocky Adam? He's like, Rocky Adam, watch out! They're like, which one? Whoa, no! Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> That's wild. I love it. Zordon looks significantly better. Yes. Mostly because you can't see him as much. Shut up, Rocky. <laughs> you suck. That's true. You knew the Rangers' power would not work in that theater. Why have you put your friends in such danger? Friends? Ha! Teleporting here and there, having all the fun, <laughs> getting all the glory. Well, it's my turn to be famous now. I'll go down in history as the one who destroyed the Power Rangers! Aww. That's pretty sick. Uh, I mean, Alpha, you're already famous. Uh, I'm and, so on Team Evil Alpha. And you're also beloved, so mm. if only he knew. This is a pretty dark storyline. This is this is horrific, honestly. I love how they just added glitter to her cheeks <laughs> to signify that it was a spell that made her look different. Yeah. It's weird that wasn't there earlier. Whoa, she got uh Yeah, how'd they end up there? She got good seats <laughs> up in the balcony. No, Kim! Aicha Oh, oh! That's actually kind of shitty. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Why did she say that like it made sense? She's like, that's what it's all about. Rita and Zed getting married. And they're like, of course. It's, yeah, I would be like, what the hell? <laughs> ah, the goat. The real goat. Oh, yeah. Drug Zed. Great. Did she just break the fourth wall? Yes. Also, who just like says their plan worked in front of their victim like that? Spencer's just looking like, what the hell? 
Wow. This is creepy. This is very creepy. It's so dark. Okay. <laughs> it's so good to have Barbara Goodson back. Yes. Yes, your majesty, what? What? Have no fear, my lord. I shall summon the punish to seize her. One step closer and you'll be monkey pate. <laughs> that day. <laughs> That's actually good. It's a good one. It's a good joke. You shall be in charge of Worst man. Ceremony. He actually is. He, he is. Unironically, he is. Wait, Goldar or Zed? No, Goldar. He is, but you know what? He at least tries more than Zed. What the hell has Zed done recently? Yeah, but like, tries and fails. Wait, wait, wait. How did he make a kissing noise? <laughs> This is, Zed has lips confirmed? I love how they could clearly see the end of the hallway, but yet they walked those extra three feet just to say dead end? How'd they get away? Did the villains just watch them I, I mean, knowing, knowing the villains, they probably did. Uh-oh, it's Snizzard, voiced by... not Brian Cranston? I need more monsters, Finster! I need enough monsters so I can keep those power punks preoccupied while I... Tie the knot with old Zeddy Boy! I just love, like, the weird... I love how the monsters just change. Wait, that was old footage! Yes. That's crazy. I mean, I'll blame her. Okay, her performance is a lot bigger this episode. Yes. I think she's easing into the role. Yes. Ash, uh -oh. the YouTuber. What? My buddy Deoxy, 365, 3... So how do you, how much you want to bet they just filmed this with them in like some random parking lot? They did. Don't get any ideas. You've done enough already. Well, I guess it's our stuff now. Quiet up there, you gaseous goon. Why would you just want to take off a bunch of random bags off the ground? Oh, what? What? This is 100% still Australia. Yeah. I don't know. What's up with those clothes? Wait, what? Blimey! <laughs> this oh, is... Oh, God. I know, I know I made the thumbnail with all the Australian things. Yeah. But, like, look. This I, show no. is literally doing all the Australian no, things. No, it was unintentionally accurate. It's a parody of how much this show is turning Australia into a parody. Also, okay, so far, I... I first of all, I just like that there's animals, but two... So far, at least they're not doing anything bad to them. We are a we are a dingo and a baby and a shrimp on the Barbie away from hitting a full bingo card of Australia. Oh God! Yikes! What? Oh my God! <laughs> just watching her drug him. He probably doesn't realize it. At this point, you probably just blindly trust her. <laughs> but this is so dark. This is morbid. This is pretty creepy. The fact that, like, the writers were like, yeah, let's have her drugs in. Yeah. I thought they were cooking. Also love they have, like, oh my god, it's a heart-shaped cup. Like, look at the lid. Shut up, Goldar. No! She made the show interesting! Goldar, you have done nothing. All you have done was drive Serpentera. <laughs> and you're not really great at that either. To be fair, again, at least he questions some of Zed's worst plans. What a fantastic way to not have the actors in this episode. Yes. Just keep them morph the entire time. Yes. We're in a cave underneath the theater. This way, guys. I see light. 
And I'm sure that's a tactic that will never be used again. I'm sure it will never it be used like again. Especially with Tommy. Fresh air? Don't you mean light? Or I mean, it could be both. Now they sw now they just switched places. Oh, this is weird. Oh, that's that nice. I love how the music cue was off. Oh my god, she's even giving him better ideas. Yeah. Just make all of so, them grow. But like, how did this, if they, how did they escape? Like, if they were not supposed to. Oh god, look at this stock footage, Jesus. I mean, are you surprised? Not surprised. Cause was the, was it supposed to be enchanted and that's why they couldn't escape? Or were Damn. they just lost? <sighs> or you don't know. It's not that I don't know, it's just that I don't care at this point. Maybe that was the point. The writers wanted to beat us down into submission so bad that we just don't want to argue any of the inconsistencies. Can I appreciate that they kept Zor um, Zordon in that getup? Yeah, it was probably cheaper to do it, let's be honest. Yeah, but I appreciate it. Oh, thank oh. God. They could have done that this entire time. I'm on board. <laughs> Screw it. I'm, I'm on team Zed. I'm on team Rita Zed at this point. Wait, what? Oh, wow, that looks suspiciously like where the quarry normally is. Yeah. You know, that old haunted house by the quarry. <laughs> also, wait. So, how quickly did the Zords get there? Well, that's that could be answered by using the morphing grid. Because the morphing grid does bring the zords there. No, it's just very uh, whatever. It do I don't know. I mean, that's probably the least ridiculous thing so far. So <laughs> vastly, I can't find words. Yeah. Oh. So what do you want to do for the next thirty minutes I while don't we know. wait for this transformation? Um. So far, the wedding has not happened. So far, not a very good wedding. I'm gonna be honest. With you. I know. I mean, here's Their the thing. Their cocktail hour? I, I would be happy for them because they're allowed to do what they want as a couple. Except Zed's not actually agreeing to do any of it. Do you think Rita's going to be wearing white? I mean, that would be normal, but knowing her, it could be something crazy. That's true. Maybe black. Ooh, that would actually be cool. We should do, like, the Catwoman aesthetic, where Catwoman more, like, white with black accents. Ooh. Oh, Tommy decided to help. That's nice of him. I feel like we never see the Tiger Zord. For as sick as it is, the Tiger Zord is sick. It is, but that's why I wish we saw it more. I wish we saw it more too, because it is awesome. You got, like, look, they're just standing up. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna make a guess. What? Um, they'll never be in the same shot. Of course. Oh, that's a great guess. I mean, oh, what? That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's good. I love that the wigs on that costume are out of control right now. Yeah. The, so the Megazord is not never in the same shot as the Tiger Zord, and the monsters are never in the same shot. Well, well wait, shouldn't... Shouldn't the Zords be okay to be in the same no, shot? No, because this is obviously two separate Zord battles where the Tiger Zord probably wasn't there for uh, either. Yeah. For this one. <laughs> oh. It's, <laughs> what? It's it's very nice that he just talks to Saba occasionally. I would I would love to hear Saba more. I was gonna say like that seems like an underutilization of resources. A hundred percent. Whoa. Whoa! Chest beam. That's so convenient. It was a long range attack. It is. Also, these poor Australians, they're not used to this, like, Angel <laughs> Grove. Oh, yeah, you're right. Australia's like, shit, guys. Uh, like, what are we doing? Whoa, 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 this is crazy. <laughs> I, I don't think they needed to say out loud they got damaged. That, that's great leadership, Rocky. It, oh, we took some serious damage. Let's try the same thing again. 
That is what they say. Yeah. Just wing it. <laughs> Thanks, Abba. I mean, yeah? Controllers. I know. Shield suddenly went down. The reactor took a major hit. Is everyone okay? Fire! Thank you, Johnny. Your voice work is stellar as usual. This is gonna be a blast. Whoa! Oh. The tiger well, sword. <laughs> they're in the same shot. Wow. Everyone out. Can can we get let someone else pilot? Well, it's too late. Too late. They're all out. Definitely wasn't from season one. That'll fix your tushies. Cause here's the thing, that whole fight easily could have just been stock footage. Speaking of stock footage. Oh, the house again. Wait, what? Wait, what? That's impossible. So that, that whole thing was pointless. This whole episode is pointless. What? I just love how Finster's like her dad. Yes. The old scrap of heap. The old scrap of heap. Like before? Well, now she's putting uh, Finster in charge. I mean, that's smart. Oh. Alpha, Zordon, do you read me? <laughs> I love how they're just sitting on this step. Because what else are they gonna do? You guys, I'm really worried. Something must have happened. It doesn't make sense. Don't get down, everyone. Remember, they're strength in numbers. Right. Yeah. 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 Maybe. Oh God. Yeah. Uh, nice. Well, that's that's a domesticated mouse. Alright. Mice are actually not dirty animals. You're thinking of rats. It's a common misconception. That's fair. I mean not nearly as dirty as as rats. You're right. And like white mice like that are pretty cute. I can't believe this is happening to me. At least there's some decent grindage. Grindage? <laughs> <laughs> Just love the putties in the background. Yeah, finally the wedding. Bring in the what? Oh, the, the guests. guests. <laughs> are, are they having a Catholic wedding? Maybe. Okay, Wait, no, okay. Th this is not how that works. No. What is this, Mad Max? <laughs> yeah, that's where, obviously, George Miller is a huge fan of Power Rangers, <laughs> and that's where he got that from. Uh, <laughs> um, I love how it's just Zed. Where's Rita? It's her wedding day. Well, what? to be fair, that's normal. <laughs> Whoa, Whoa, cake what, topper. Cake? Using action figures. But to be fair, the bride does come in last. That's like the yeah, least weird. Yeah, they usually weird... don't process gifts. No, that part's weird. Thank you. What an all. My gift to you, Lord Zed, is for decoration or for a light snack. You monsters, I like beautiful. That's dumb. Yeah. We're all one. Like me and son, so you're just sending your kids out to constantly get killed. What about the Dark. Swords, you guys? What happened to them? It was like someone shut the power switch off. <laughs> The White Ranger suit actor just did a bobblehead, like, Not you two again. We'll be right outside the door, They're so unthreatening that the Rangers don't even care that they're there. Yeah, and if we do get out, how do we keep Zed from sending us back? We've been in worse spots. We just need to stick together, guys. Right. Same, that's how we... We can do it. Maybe let's come up with an actual plan. Yeah. Um, this is rough. 
I'm slowly dying on the inside. This episode did nothing. This episode accomplished nothing. It, it's, it doesn't even deserve to exist. What, what happened? You need to stretch stuff out. The, the, the whole purpose of this episode is stretching out, is just buying time. Like... So they could film the movie. This is insane. It is insane, but are you really that surprised? I'm not, but I didn't think we could get this low. Like, this is... Like, the Rita stuff saved it. We didn't even get that much Alpha dunking on Zordon. No. I'm glad that Zordon's gone, because <laughs> now we could actually have a good show, but... Yeah. Uh, but this is crazy. Like, the whole... The ranger started in... Trapped in the mansion. Yeah. yeah. Surrounded by monsters. The episode ends with the rangers trapped in the mansion, surrounded by monsters. It, so the next episode will begin with the same status quo as the beginning of this episode. Which, you could... In a, in a better written show, you can make the argument that there's, like, a horrifying aspect of that. Of being like, hey, we did everything and we're back where we started. They did, but it doesn't come off that way. It just comes off like they just I'll need to stretch you why, it out. Because in a better show, they would have used this episode to develop the characters. Yeah. But that's not what this episode did. The whole episode, we followed the Rangers' attempt to escape. And when they did, they were sent back immediately with no development or character work whatsoever. And the other thing is, is what was... Well, okay, no, I'm, I answer my own question. So the, the main reason they lost was because of Alpha. So yeah. on that basis, then maybe they should have done more with Alpha at least. Yeah, like, this is no character work for Alpha, because this is Alpha... Doing the same thing as last episode. Yeah. Other than, the big thing was, he got rid of Zordon. Yeah, I mean, thank God for that. <laughs> but that other that's than, a huge win. But other than that, it's... Yeah. It's bad. It, it's something. At least the wedding started, so now At least not... we can finally watch the wedding. I didn't get a gift. No. Do you think I... they'll mind? They wouldn't mind, but who cares? Yeah, who cares? We'll, we'll just duck out early, grab some cake, and... I got a gift. Way. My fists. Nice. Um, and then the bulk and skull stuff, while cute, was very weird. Again, they're just, they just took. If it's like they took them to to a safari. Yeah. And, and just shot just shot them, and I feel like we're just gonna get those shots. Yeah. Over the next like five episodes. Yeah, I mean, by all means, it's cute. I like the wildlife, but that has nothing to do with the story. We're like. <laughs> and also, like, it's also weird. Like, why does Alpha care? Other than he's just evil. He's just a prey. I don't know what else, I don't know what else to say. There's nothing to say about this episode because this episode is nothing. It is. It's um, a nothing episode. It's a nothing episode. It's still very dark with the fact that Rita did I'm, what she did. I'm just laughing because I I have a feeling that someone in the comments is gonna be like, "How dare you? This is my favorite episode." <laughs> or like, "These are my favorite episodes." And I'm like, "Okay, watch them again as an adult." Yeah, I mean, but again, if you're happy that Rita returned, sure. Yeah, I'm glad Rita's back, but come on. This, this middle episode... And they always do this in three-parters. I always feel like every time there's a three-parter, the, the middle one sucks because yes. it's just them stalling and drawing out the runtime. Which is absurd because we know it's not impossible in multi-parters to make the middle parts good. Look I mean, at Green with Evil! Yes. It was five parts and each part mattered and built the story. Yeah. If anything, the end of it was the weakest part, so... Take me back to those days. Yes. To simpler times. Because I think, I think this is fair to say, you can have filler, but it cannot suck. This is not even filler because nothing, they filled nothing. Yeah. This is just space. This is just like, whatever. <laughs> my God, like, my, just like, I feel like every week I just get punched in the face. Five Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. Protect yourself. Be careful. The, may the power protect me. If you guys like this video, make sure to give it a huge thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, subscribe. And hit the notification bell to stay up to date on all of latest content. If you want to check out our other Power Ranger reactions, click the link on the page. Until next time, guys, stay versed and may the power